Welcome. So what we're going to do is we're going to find the area of this triangle. Now, when finding the area of the triangle, it's best to kind of go back and look at a rectangle and determine how do we find the area of a rectangle and how does that relate to a triangle. So let's just kind of go back. If I had a rectangle, all right, we determine that the area of this is going to be our base times our height. So we can say the area inside is equal to base times height. Now, when we're looking at a triangle, if I was going to create a kind of a triangle out of this, we can say that the triangle is going to be exactly 1 half of the area of that rectangle. So we say the area of this triangle, if I have the same base and the same height, well, the triangle is not the same area, right? It's actually exactly half. So the area of a triangle equals 1 half base times height. Now, this triangle gets a little bit more confusing because you can say, well, I'm not creating a 90 degree. How is this going to relate? Well, since I still have the base and I still have the height, the formula is going to be exactly the same because I can draw a triangle, I'm sorry, a rectangle over this that it would be exactly double this problem or double this area. So to find the area here, I'm just going to have area equals 1 half base times height. So in this case, I have area equals 1 half my base, which is 7, times my height, which is 6.6. .6. All right. Therefore, my area is going to equal 23.1 yards squared. Remember, area is going to be um, dealing with our dimension squared. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you find the area of a triangle. Thanks.